Kitty Cats, what's going down? I received a lot of questions yesterday uh, from yesterday's video about rep ranges um, and people wanted me to clear up a little bit more about this rep cycling thing I spoke about. So, there's a few ways that you can do this with this rep cycling thing and the, the best way to think of it is having a wide variety of reps over the course of your program. Now, as I said, there's a few ways you can do this. First is you can have Let's just say like two, four, six, okay? So you can do a few things. First is you can do two, four, six in the one exercise. So let's say your first exercise for the day was bench press. So you can do a set of two, rest, a set of four, rest, a set of six, right? So you did three sets, first set was two, second set was four, third set was six. That's one way. Two is you can actually do it in the workout itself or the, the training day. So for example, First exercise is bench press, and you just do two reps. Five sets of two, something like that. Your second exercise is, let's say it's, it's dumbbell shoulder press. You do five sets of four. Your third exercise is, I don't know, pull-ups. Excuse me, you do five sets of six. So you see over the course of your workout, you cover all rep ranges. Now, you could do it over the course of the week. So for example, Monday program, all the exercises, you just do two reps. Wednesday's program, all the exercises, you just do four. Friday's program, you do six. You could do it over the course of the month. First week, you just do two reps. Second week, you do four, rep, four reps. Third week, you do six reps. Fourth week, you go back to two. You could do it over the course over a couple months. Month one is all two reps. Month two is all four reps. Month three is all six reps. So you can see how you have so many different options and that's why I like it so much because it's just got so much variety and as I said, you kill so many birds with one stone. You, you cover everything, you don't leave anything behind second guessing, well should I do high reps, should I do medium reps, should I do low reps? Just fucking do them all. <laughs> so as I said, if you, if you download that three by 15 workout above in this corner video here, in the corner of this video here, I'm pretty sure um, I can't remember what kind of theme I went with, but I think I, I go it over the course of the week. So you'll see how I've, I've rep cycled. Actually, no, I do it over the course of the week and in the one training program. Ah, so now we get even more tricky. So if you download, so you download that, that program now, you'll be able to see yourself how I do that. Um, but if you, as I said, you cover all different rep ranges, um, you take out the guesswork of whether you should be doing high reps, medium reps, low reps, whatever and you get the best of all worlds. So, hopefully that helps. Take care. Comb your fucking...